It is Friday, my dudes. Welcome one, welcome all! We're gonna be continuing our playthrough of Inscription, which doesn't even have a new game feature. Ah! Oh. Ah! Oh. Sounds just so good. Oh, so good. We got the chance to play through uh, Inscription for about four hours and change yesterday. We went through uh, two campaigns. Two campaigns, two runs. Uh, we lost in the second one in a devastating fashion. So now we're getting eager, we're getting excited, we're getting thrilled, we're getting delighted to do run number three. We've solved some of the puzzles in the main room, but I'm very curious what more awaits. All right, so what's in the deck? We got stink bug, we got stoat, bullfrog, wolf. Excellent. No, you may not choose a specific beast. Instead, you must decide on a tribe that you prefer. Lizard? Wolf? Elk? Let's go elk. A randomly chosen hooved card. Ah, interesting. Did you wish for something else? An ancient woman emerged from behind an oak tree. She carefully laid out intricate wood carvings, then gestured at them brusquely. Choose. Dude, infiniteness? The old woman bared her teeth in satisfaction. Your first totem was complete. The many live sigil will now be marked upon all your squirrel creatures. So broken. So one thing that I forgot to do was go to the tooth. They're not here? All right. So it looks like some of the stuff that I did last time didn't quite get saved. But I'll just go ahead and take this with me. So squirrel and moose buck. I had a theory that this will open up when I have this board state. So strange. Why can't I remember his name? I believe I lost some of my memories. In the flash? Yeah, some blocks flyers. Let's go ahead and put my squirrel here. Go ahead and put a bullfrog out here. Whoops, I just lost my squirrel. <laughs> oh, no. You know what? It's what I wanted anyways. It's what I wanted anyways. Squirrely, oh. All right, so let's go ahead and put the squirrel here. Let's go ahead and place the wolf right here. Perfect. Gotcha. Good play. Nice. Elk? Oh my. So I, I want to do this just to make sure that we can get a lot of points. Give me them teeth. What up, Harlem Globe Trotter? What up, Link? We're currently playing some sweet ass inscription, you know what I'm saying? Random ant, random hooved guy. Oh, since I closed, do I not get to keep the one that I that we made together? I, we lost mine, right? Oh no. Am I asking? Yeah, no, I, I'm, I'm, I'm really confused. 
Th this is an actual genuine question. I assume that Bill Nobrash and Ingeline, they'll be off where they appear. Ah, okay. All right, great. There's a moose buck. So if I look over here, moose buck squirrel. Well, maybe the fact that my squirrels are infinite means I can't get that. The bones of the ancient woman creaked and groaned as she approached. Okay, here's the rule right now. Here's the rule. If I say out loud, how does this work? Why is this that way? I am not asking you. I'm speaking rhetorically. Only when I specifically say, this is not a rhetorical question. I genuinely want to know. That's the cue. That's the cue. All right. The bones of the ancient woman creaked and groaned as she approached. Gently shaking hands, she placed her offerings before you. So... I can put... So does this replace one of these? So I'm gonna do this and see what happens. So I can only make one combination. And I don't know if I can have two. I don't know if I can have two. How the fuck do I leave? What the fuck? The old woman collected her pieces and shuffled off into the darkness. Great. I don't know what this water drop thing is. Let's do it. I don't like our deck very much. Greetings. So what happens if I do this? Let's find out. Elder Squirrel? No. Well, I got really bad news, because we're about to lose, huh? I kind of I kind of want to just abandon the run. I, I really don't like these cards that we have. I mean, I literally think I just lost here, huh? Stink bug over here. Okay, wait. So I have some questions. So, I mean, if I pass, we just win. I guess I'll just take this and just win. Look, there's a third talking card somewhere around here. Personally, I hate the guy. Biggest killjoy ever. But he's the only one of us with a plan to get things back to normal. Alright. Oh yeah, four and four, huh? You have me here, I surrender. What happens if I take this? I don't remember. Okay. You must make a different kind of choice now. Choose not a specific beast, but decide the cost that you wish to play. This is some number of bones, hence bone axe. I'll choose this one. The mantis. Cool. I, I, I'm really fascinated by the fact that the, the game keeps just changing. Like, the, the collection of rules just is different every time. I really hate this deck, like, a lot. 
So let's get the uh, multi Lulu Dallas multi attack. We will give the wolf multi attack. Nice. Let's fight. Let's go. Let's go. Salutations. <laughs> Lucky draw. Yeah, I mean. Wolf come. <laughs> play the stoat. Bad play. Ah, oh, shut up. Ah, shut up. Did oh, it? Sorry, guy. I miscounted. I have real shame saying that to you, you know. Oh wait, do I lose? No, I'm okay. For some reason, is th this this run just feels so rough. Feels so hard. Like this whole this whole grown up squirrel business. I just do not give a shit about. So if I go squirrel, and then I go squirrel, and then I go sack sack, and then I place this one here, then when I end the turn, it'll go whack whack, and he'll scoot his booty over here. So wait a minute. If I do this, and then I... Yes! Yes, 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 yes. All right. We got something. Oh my gosh, I figured it out. Oh my god, I love seeing Chad just suddenly, suddenly just get deleted. It's incredible. I think I'm gonna go like this. Hmm? The sadistic pronghorn. Woe be to those that meet the end of its antlers. Alright. Dude. It's grizzly. It's grizzly time. All right, let's see here. Decrepit woodcarver appeared before you. Perfect. She moved with a certain vigor in spite of her considerable age. Oh my god. Dude. Yeah, I'll take this one. Yeah, I'll take this one. We have trinket squirrels. Yeah, we have trinket squirrels. All right, this is... Th is this the run? This is the run. This is the urn. Chill mist goes in around you. You are not alone. A figure emerged from the fog. Stand in the way of my goal, be darned. All right, great. Shit, dude. 
Dude, this is gonna be sick. All right. All right, thing. What is this? This is just some bones, huh? Let's crack it. All right, nice. Oh my god. All right. All right, so if I just place this one here, what do we get? All right, so let's put this here. Oh, this is this is tight. <laughs> I mean, I mean, it's it's hard to imagine a situation in which I won't be just going for squirrels every turn. Oh, I always forget this part. Oh, I always forget this part. Good, good, good gold I've struck. Rah, rah, rah. Always expensive. Sh oh. This is broken. This is like so good. I mean, this is this is ridiculous. <laughs> Extinguish thy flame. Need a light. Need a light. I think I'm gonna win this run tonight. All right. Rare card, Adrayuli. Pack rat, child 13. No, we're going for the, that's not a D, that's a U, it's an U Urayuli. Did you name this one letter at a time? Was that you? Oh my God, I'm gonna get the Urayuli. We're gonna get the thickest one ever. It's a four mana seven seven. This meme was presented to me yesterday, put it in my pocket, use it again today, and people are just like, he's just so culturally nostalgic. How does he do it? He repeats what he sees. That's how he's done it. After the harrowing encounter with the Prospector, you gathered yourself and continued onwards and upwards. I forgot what this one is. I don't remember what this one is. I don't think I'm gonna do this. Well, I don't think I'll. The card might actually be nice. Definitely gonna go this way. I don't remember what the double blood is. The buzzing and tripping of insects drowned out the sound of your footfalls. You beheld the wetlands. I see. Pricey. Moose Buck. I don't give a Moose Buck. Uh, I see Ghost Stalker timed out a moral zombie for continuing with the fun. Oh my god. What's the difference between a hippo and a zippo? One weighs a ton, and the other's a little lighter. Isn't that good? Upon an old wood carver who brought her after an overlong sense with off your burns. So 
Oh, death touch, bird touch. Let me just get the bear. Let me still put squirrel packing on. Dude, squirrel packing is just fucking sick. Squirrel packing is Ban the streamer. Ban him. No! Boo! Boo! Alright, so this is... This is... Get some stink fists going. Stink. Skink. Stinky. Skinky. Alright, so let me... Let me just go ahead and... So this is my only item. Okay. Was that Boo of Princess Bride reference? It was Phosphorus. He's just so cultural this day and night. Skunk. Adders have it batter. See what we get. Oh, this is a fucking item? This fucking hook is a fucking item? Are you kidding me? Throwaway items like it's no one's business. Dude, I literally win. But I'm gonna play this first to see if I can get another good item. Oh, dude, black go. That's perfect for next run. Easy. I mean, this is incredible. Alright. Kaka ants. I'm gonna do this because he's gonna be a bone daddy. Great rattler. Is that the only hook you'll ever get and you use it on a snake? Yeah, yeah, I did. I did. I'm incredible. How's the game treating us today? Well, it was treating us. It was treating us just goddamn bad for a little bit. It was actually like hurting us. Let's see. Who do we want to be able to block aerials? Holy grizzly. distribute my power at least a little bit. <sighs> it's the squirrel of the day. Ants in a pants. Alright, so... <laughs> oh shit! Ring a ding ding, it's a grizzly on your thing. Oh my god, he's ranting so hard. So hard, darling. Uh, yeah, I'll take a squirrel. Let's get this here. Let's go ahead and place the uh, squirrely. Creatures attack as though they had flying shit. So, I mean, I need to use an item every single turn. Just like every turn, I need to use an item. Because I have a free tooth and a snipper. I don't remember what this is. I feel like I should. What's this one again? It's like a card based upon a class. A nascent fawn, it quickly grows into an elk. Ship it. We're going like Moose Gaming. You found yourself among a grove of thick and pungent mushrooms. You squinted to see through a figure. Or see a figure through a thick cloud. We are the mycologists, yes? Anytime I see a yes like this, I actually do this a lot. I, I, I like to say a thing, yeah? We're going to do this, yes? I don't know why. I don't know why I do this. Every time I see this sort of thing, yes? Then Gordon Ramsay. Yes. 
and we are performing our experiments far from from we are not welcome elsewhere this reminds me of the winning look from i think it was season 11 of rupaul's drag race one of the most like artistic brilliant boundary pushing queen ever evie oddly holy shit look up evie oddly evie oddly's looks are just god tier just god tier it's incredible it's incredible man and um she came out with um she had like this this crown with mirrors like this um that reflected i'm gonna get the picture i'm gonna get the picture Evie, come here. Evie, oddly winning look. I mean, it, it, it had this, like, beautiful horror aesthetic to it. Let me see if I can... This is not a, a particularly good one. All right, you ready? You ready? You ready? Dude, it had this, this look where like there are mirrors in here, but it was at like a perfect 45 degree angle. So it, it looked, when she was looking head on the camera, it, it was like pointing out the side. I mean, and the rest of the of the dress was fucking beautiful. Yeah, it's, it's, it's this beautiful, creepy look, right? And that's, when I look at this, I'm just like, that's sick. Isn't that, it's like a Dark Souls boss? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fucking sick. We are not welcome elsewhere. We will experiment on your flock, yes. We will need two of the same creatures, one for each of us. Yeah, what happens here? Do we get the moosest buckest? Do we get the moosest buckest? I think this could get medicine. Mega moose. All right. Look away. <laughs> yeah, the m moose buck is it one now? I assume that what this game does is it just chops the uh, fucking words off and mashes it together. But it was a moose buck to begin with, so it's just the it's just the moose buck. <laughs> Gruesome. All right. Skink and a ratla. All right, well, let's go ahead and play this. See what we get. Let's take an extra turn, sure. Ding. All right, cool. Let's take one of these. Let's play a squirrel. Let's see what we get. We get snippers. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and... Here, here, here. Ghost Star, I wouldn't worry too, too, too much about deleting some of these spoilers, because the fact of the matter is that I'm not looking a lot of the time. But I do trust your judgment, Ghost Star. Oh, when when you snip, it's a wriggling tail, anyways. Oh, okay, so that's that's a little different than I'd expected. First things first, we're gonna play a squirrel. We're gonna play at least one, one, one damage. It's like not a huge deal. Some more bones. So, can I use this on that one? No, I can't. Do -do 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 -do. 
I'll lose the squirrel because I just. Some derpa. This is a lot of shit. Oh, this is. This is the guy. Well, shit. I guess I'll take one of these, I guess. Oh, did I just make a mistake? Yeah, I think I may have. Well, it's good. It's good to make mistakes sometimes. I'm do like this. We're gonna need a lot of teeth. Oh, this this one is not thorns. Oh, he's not. He's not thorns. This is this is the power buffer. So, so, let me just go ahead and play a squirrel here. Good, we got a squirrel. Okay. Squirrel here. Alright, let's just use this. Forgot that it did that. Gets me every time. Got this. Okay, so I'm gonna cut this and this, put him here. I love the little tiny effect. Oh my god, someone forgot it worked that way. Oh my god. D9 Gamer. Ah, the elusive otter submerges itself during my turn. Beehive? Rattler. What? Is this a tooth that comes with it or something? He is beginning to believe. Warm a creature by the fire, enhance its health. This is a hungry survivor. <laughs> I'm gonna get my moving elks to be a little healthier. Seems good. We could go for that incredible 618. <laughs> oh. To smoke. The mud tugged hard at your feet, forcing you to slow your pace. A rank odor caused your stomach to churn and your eyes to water. It was the rotting fish that hung from the branches around you. A huge man approached. Great. Alright, so let's just... Oh, he's not gonna pull it on that turn? Well, fuck. Alright. I wish I hadn't done that, but that's alright. Boom. Oh, it's a flyer. remember exactly how this worked, but if I do this, put this here, and then I play Urayali, and then I play Go Fish. Play this to get another. Alright. <laughs> it's 
<laughs> All right, your lives are restored. Dude, squirrel items is just busted. That's great. Choose carefully. No, I'm not doing that. All right. The dogs. That filthy feral hog, it becomes incensed when its chimes are struck. Bellist. When a card bearing the bellist is played, a chime is created on each empty adjacent space. A chime is defined as zero power, one health. Okay. Huh. I, I'm gonna get the pack rat, man. It could all well. Uh, okay, so here is a non-rhetorical, actual question: Are the bells sacrificable? Because I I would really love to get some rant. This is a real, legitimate, actual, non-rhetorical question. Tell me. The moral zombie says yes. Sean, do bells bleed in this game? Apparently, yes. Kamir Douse. Because, I mean, my build is pretty straightforward. Extremely expensive cards. Squirrels that make items. Moving past the pond, you took a deep breath of fresh air and continued on. You don't think... Wow, about half of you say yes, half of you say no. You guessed at the path ahead as the snow increasingly obscured as you had climbed to the snow line. Snow hope! Let me get the pronghorn. If I put this on here, does it does it give it to both of them? Yeah, fuck yeah, man. Oh, God, this is a good run. Moose buck. Let's get some bones. Just wins, right? Three and three. <laughs> okay. Okay. Alright, I think I think I feel like we're doing pretty good. Alright. Alright, trial of power, three drawn cards move me four. Trial of wisdom, it's at least three sigils. Trial of health. Alright, so. One, so we have one, two, three cards without sigils. We have a card of two, two, one, two. This is, this is about one of cards. This is a near 100% chance. Six health, though. Is there any combination that doesn't give six health? It would be like a one, a one, and a two, one, a one, and three, one, a one. Yeah, and then we have uh, four power. Is there any way to get less than four power here? There is not. So that's 100%. One, one. Yeah. Let the trial of power begin. <laughs> All right, we got 13. Success, fuck yeah. Damn. In the 
flying hiding shark is pretty disgusting. This is just a guaranteed four damage a turn. We have another devil wolf. I, I, I like the ability to play in this, so I'm just going to get this really pricey one. Survivors. There's room for one creature. We'll increase its power. Get my fucking wolf leveled up. You kidding me, man? The power of the wolf was enhanced by the warmth. Great. Hell yeah. I mean, I, I feel like this, this run is going great. Add a squirrely. The douse. Raven egg. Alright, first things first. Play the squirrel. Alright, skip your turn. Alright, let's end it. Let's get a... <laughs> this is awesome. Let's get a squirrel. Let's play the squirrel. Get some bones. Yeah, it seems good. So if I do this... That's not enough. But if then I do this and this... And I do this... And then if I do... You fucking lied to me. Well, let's just win on the turn one anyways. Oh my god, that card fucking sucks, man. Oh, that card's like really bad. We gotta get that one out of here. Oh yeah, worker ant. The diligent worker ant. What's what's this mushroomable mean? Is that, is that what it is that I like? Just get more moose box? This deletes a card. I'm just gonna get rid of the one that we just got, huh? I just saw a chat get deleted. That's great news. That is great news. Bad chat. Hmm. So let me be clear. If I say, I uh, clear the chat again one more time, Ghosty. If I specifically say this is a non rhetorical question, yada, 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 this game has lots of mystery. This game has lots of mystery. You know, let me, make, let me just make a point again. No backseating. Stop fucking backseating for fuck's sake, please. Stop fucking backseating. Next person that backseats, insta ban for life. Get out of here. Or probably for an hour. Just something. So the message is across. Hmm. I tried to drink this water and I missed it. It's because I was full of passion. So let me explain something. I am a broadcaster. My job is to talk while I play. That's what I do. So often I'll say things like, huh, I wonder what this means. What do you think that means? Interesting. That's just me talking. I'm not saying, hey you, tell me what happened, spoil the ending. You know, it's kind of just like, oh gosh, this this person feels mysterious. I wonder what his identity is. Oh, listen, in book four, you'll discover that's, that's the main character's brother. You know what I mean? Don't do it. You need to delete a card, huh? I think the douse will probably actually be somewhat valuable. I hate to say it, but I think the stoat. Bad play. Bone daddy. Boop. Squirrel. I mean, it's close. We might be able to get another turn one kill with Rayuli. Oh, am I be able to? Oh, oh. All right, frozen possum. 
Let's get a little squirrely. A frozen opossum here. Dude, this is this is just a just a shrekin. Gonna end the turn. Great. Squirrel time. Squirrel goes here. Oh, look. The boulder. Go ahead and take that now. Uh, oh, actually, I should probably wait until next turn. That's fine. Uh, so, what I'm going to do is just win everything I'm thinking. This is seven damage to the face, huh? You know what? I'll get some overkill. Great. So that's gonna double strike the air. Oh, black goat, I want that so bad. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's the true goat. Uh, so this is where I can mash some stuff. I don't really want any more cards. I'm going to go here. This feels incredible. 14 in the air. I have a lot of teeth, man. I want some pelts. Trial of bones. Trial of sigils. Trial of power. I did it. All right. Trial is passed. What do I get? Actually, I'm gonna get a raven egg. Let's do. Let's let's mushroom it up. Two of the same. Okay. <laughs> you know what? I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna smash the rattlers. I'm gonna smash the rattlers. I think this is better. You may want to avert your eyes. Rattler. Dude, it still costs six. Fuck yeah. Hell yeah. I know, I am a coward. It's true, it's true. Never more disappointed. Dude, you get a 614. Ease up, ease up. Stand down. Smoke. A man stood before you, a man you recognize immediately. It was the trapper. You reached out to examine his wares, but he stopped you. Sorry, but today you will supply the pelts. When a card bearing the sigil perishes, the creature opposing it perishes as well. The pelt is created in your hand. Strange frog. This music is spectacular. The boulder. Let's put this here. Let's go ahead and get the grizzly right. Smoke. 
be a squirrel, baby. Leaping trap. That's not good. All right. <laughs> it's so, it's so busted, man. It's so busted. Exquisite pelts, but the cycle must continue. Let's trade. Of course, accept only the finest pelts for them. What does this mean? What does this mean, huh? Accept only the finest pelts for them. Okay. Trade for what you can, but know this. The rest will stay and fight for me. Oh, shit, 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 shit. I didn't realize that was the fucking interface. Oh, God. I got interface owned. This is the one that I wanted. I wanted the great white. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, I'm so annoyed. We win on this turn, don't we? Because this is four, and this is four, and this can't block. But this is four and two. I mean, we just we just win, right? Oh, you got me. Fuck. All right. Poison is bare. It's gonna fly over regardless, it's gonna fly over regardless. So we're taking five damage right away. So we need one of these to be good. Good, it's combo dog. That's good stuff. Okay. Boulders. Doesn't really matter. Just come in and crack back. I think I see the win. So what I do is I take the wolf. I'm going to sacrifice these two. I place this one here. So this is going to deal some amount of damage here. It's going to overkill through. This, it just passes through is my understanding. So I should deal four. And then if I use this, now I'm four away from a win. But in case I messed up, I'm going to put the smoke there. Yep. Yep. All right, great. Easy. You will not perish quite yet. I took a moment, because I, th I thought I actually had six damage to the face in the last one. Get in here, man. Are you kidding me? All the way are all these, man. With the enigmatic trapper and traitor now bleeding into the snow, you persisted. You can see a light in the distance. The end is near. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We will need another map. Wait.
What is this? What the hell is going on? So do I want to upgrade a thing? Boop, boop, boop. Okay. I actually like this little combo here. This, this guy's fragile, so I can like weaken the thing in front of it. That seems pretty good. Your eyes have fixed themselves on the small cabin, its warm light a beacon in the oppressive darkness of the night. Surely, surely this cabin marked the end of your travails. Is that where we're in? Is that where I'm at right now? Steps away from the strange cabin, you are presented with an opportunity. I don't offer my boons to just any traveler. If you are able to pass my trials, you'll be rewarded mightily. Trial of the Swift. The three drawn cards must include a card with the Sprinter sigil. Trial of the Winged. Trial of Skins. Alright, let's begin the Trial of the Swift. Ah, Moosebuck is a card with the Sprinter Sigil. Success. I'll grant you one of my most powerful boons. Cards that dramatically alter the game. You don't even need to draw them. Boon of the Ambidextrous. You may draw twice at the beginning of your turn. That's the one. Boon of the Bone Lord. You'll start with a bag of eight bones. Start with a uh, grant for... Oh my god, dude. Give me this. We'll repeat that once more. Really? Three drawn cards must include a Waterborn, a rare card. It's gonna be this one. Trial the rarity. Not a single rare card. Failure. All right. Seems fine. Oh, yeah. You managed to get a boon. Can I just say, this reminds me so much <coughs> of a style of game that only ever very briefly existed. Any of you ever play Lands of Lore? Any of you remember this? Or play these? It was, it was a very early foray into 3D games. Because, you know, th there's the idea of fully 3D graphical rendering, which, you know, I feel like the Nintendo 64 was like a really big moment where you'd actually have like real-time 3D environments and worlds and stuff, but... Um, Lands of Lore was a game where it worked just like this, where you would hit a button and you would scoot forward and scoot and scoot. So it was kind of like a 3D world but it was on a tile grid and it was all rendered in 2D. Um, you managed to get a boo. This may be a fair competition. And it was like this, where you'd like journey. Oh, this is interesting. If I turn sideways, nothing happens, but if I try to go back, it just turns me around. Lucky the Care Burst is similar to the original Doom. Well, the original Doom actually had fully full movement. But it um, this is a tile-based movement. I'm here and I hit a button, and now I've moved to this tile. I've hit another button, and I've moved to this tile. I've hit another button, and I've moved to this tile. So you you just gonna be going like chick, 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 scooting around.
took your time out there. I'm actually surprised that I'm pleased with this reveal. And I'm itching for another game. Are you ready to play? Hope you're adequately prepared. It just extinguishes both and I immediately lose. Or perhaps one more to be safe. smoke here. Oh, it, it did that. Oh, shit. What happens if I just end the turn here, huh? Oh, the mole. I'm a dumbass. Why does he do that here? Shit. Spot. Alright. He's functioning different than we believed. I'm just going to use these now, even though that's very painful. Oh shit, that fucking hurts to watch. Shit, that's fucking really bad news. I can't actually play anything. Looks like there's this sort of like alternation thing that's happening between them. So next time, I think that I need to. I suppose if I looked at the tool that was like maybe behind him, I could understand what would be happening at the end of the turn. But the thing that's actually really funny about this game is that you are about to win at every single step. Um. Like, doing five damage in one turn is, like, not a lot. Like, that's pretty straightforward. Um, and so it's interesting, because it allows the game to create what seems like nothing but unfair bullshit situations that you can overcome because your cards are always getting better. I would like a memento. I forgot about the mole. Your death card. Let us begin. Please choose a card to draw the cost from. Four, three, or two. Let's go with two. Now. Okay, let's use the power and health of the moose buck. That seems good. I think a 614 is pretty good. Extract the sigils. I 
mean, I guess it's going to be this one. Sigil of the Fledgling and Sigil of Stinky from the Raven. I never did ask you your name. Kane and Flaxvine, give me give me a number between 3 and 16. Kane and Flaxvine, give me a number between 3 and 16. Let's do it. Mm, Kane and Flaxvine, let's do it. 10! 10 is perfect. Chaos Ratchet, you just bribed us for $5. Go ahead and give us the very first letter of this new name. Come on, Chaos Ratchet. And at me when you do. At me when you do. Bribes? Yes. If you gift five subs, you just automatically get to choose the next one. Chaos Ratchet is going to be letter number one. Letter number one. Oh, look at that. An anonymous gifter just gifted to Suna. Is Chaos Ratchet not there? My god. It might have to be Blue Jonaleth who just gifted us five. Blue Jonaleth who just gifted us five. Give us the very first letter. Let me just make sure. Yeah, let's ratchet. Please, please let me know if you are alive. Oh, Blue Jonalith asks for the number J. That is perfect. Number J. Ideal. Mockthal gifting five subs to us. Lucky the Care Bear gifting us five subs. Beautiful bribery. Lucky the Care Bear. Go ahead and give me letter number two and Mockthal be on weight. Be on hold. Just prepare yourself. We've got the number J to kick things off. One of the 26 letters of the alphabet we love is Y. G. Aw, oh, G. You thick, stinky, growing 614. Mockfall, what, what's letter number three, do you think? Letter number three. What do you think it's going to be? What do you think letter three is going to be, Mockthal, who just gifted us five and is staying alive? R! Ah, yes. Bring about good cheer for all. Oh, Wandering Introvert just gifted five subs. Wandering Introvert, I was wondering if you could channel your inner extrovert and give us the fourth letter of this name. Give us fourth letter. Is a Z. Ah, yes. I am a big fan of Jersey Shore. Ah, oh, we have good old Jersey Strider 7, who gave a letter yesterday, is coming back for more with the five gifted subs. Thanks, Strider 7. Help us with letter number five. We're about to be halfway there. About to be halfway there. Come on, Jeers. Come on, Strider 7. What's it gonna be? An A. Oh, yeah, you know, sometimes you don't gotta choose a weird letter. You can just choose the first one, right? Jeers, uh... Yes, uh, jeers. Ah, jeers, uh, jeers, uh, jeers. Uh. Now, it looks like Chaos Ratchet has come on back. Chaos Ratchet, we missed you. You now have an opportunity to do letter number six. Please at me. I saw you type before. I saw you type before, but I would be delighted to get letter number six from you again. Letter number six. I just want to make sure that there wasn't a chat delay or something to that tune. Chaos, please give us letter number six. And letter number seven, Nostalgia Parade. You're going to be coming up. You're going to be coming up, Nostalgia Parade. You're going to be coming up. We're not going to ask anything from you yet, Nostalgia Parade. Where's Chaos? Where did Chaos Ratchet go? We got to get Chaos Ratchet's letter. Now, Chaos Ratchet did type a letter, but it was a while back when I was in the middle of speaking to someone else. So I want to make sure that the letter is, in fact, the same. Chaos said L... I was in the middle of talking at that point in time. I was in the middle of talking at that point in time. This is why I've been asking for confirmation. We were in the middle of getting a letter from someone else, and Chaos Ratchet came on in. I want to try to be thoughtful. You gotta send that letter, Chaos Ratchet. We're gonna give you ten more seconds, but then we gotta skip you. We gotta skip you. He's got slow internet. Give him a minute. Could be. That could be that could be true. That could be true. That could be true. You know what? Let's just let's just chill. Chaos Ratchet, open up chat. Everyone's talking to you. Everyone's talking to you live. Mr. Ratchet. Or Mrs. Ratchet. Or MX Ratchet. Now we have some more we have some, some additional bribes coming. We have some additional bribes coming in. From Jack Latou is gifted one. Nostalgia Parade. Let's not forget them. Let's not forget them. I 
I think I think we might just have to. I'm just gonna hang. I'm just gonna hang. Isn't that sad? Isn't that sad? Some of you wanted to see me complete the game in my third run. Well, looks like. Chaos Ratchet is testing. Beautiful, Chaos Ratchet. Beautiful. There's Chaos Ratchet. Ah, perfect. It's a P. Look at that. Jeer Zap. Thank you so much, Chaos Ratchet. You got in. Beautiful. Dude, we got Jeer Zap. Jeer Zap. Dot by do Zap. All right. Well, Nostalgia Parade. Nostalgia Parade. Please give us. The seventh letter. That was a good wait. That's a perfect letter. The the jeer zap. Good old Bill Knobrash helped us out a little yesterday. We're gonna see what's gonna happen with jeer zap. Uh, nostalgia. Can you give us the next letter? You know, I like drinking out of a mug. I'm just gonna pour this Perrier straight into my coffee mug. And oh, beautiful nostalgia parade. Beautiful. Uh, uh, Jirzapo. There's the Gestapo, and then there's the Jirzapo. This is, this is, this is good. This is much more of a harsh, poppy name. It looks like someone doing their best impersonation of poorly pronouncing Polish. But let's, let's continue onward. Let's continue onward. We had, we had another one. Oh, I know we had five gifted. I read the name. Oh, of course. It's Jack Latou. Jack Latou, can you give me the eighth letter? Letter reads. Jack Latou says, Sean, it's got to be another O. Ah, yes. Jeer <laughs> Zapu. <laughs> That's a very astute observation. That's a very astute one. That's, you're correct. I, do, I wouldn't have seen that. I wouldn't have seen that. That's a good identification. That that's the correct letter eight. Hey, Link. Link, I normally see you stop in on Friday. I hope your week is winding down and your ability to give letters is winding up because I need you to give letter number nine here. Letter number nine is going to be on Link. L-I-N-C. Yeah. This is a big one. This is a big one. Ah, man, the letter H. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Jirzapu. Ah, yes. Marzipan loves Jirzapu. All right. And and to, to close things out, to close things out, I'm going to reset something. Mike Ralphone, who was uh, time added for backseating, take this freeze frame image as an opportunity to close us out strong. Because remember, you did get time added for backseating, but we believe in redemption here at Day9 TV. We believe in redemption. And I know that you will be redeeming us with letter 10. With letter 10. Winnie the Jerzapu. And remember, don't don't succumb to peer pressure. Z ah Jerzapoos. <laughs> well done. Well done, yes. I never did ask your name. Why? It's Jerzapoos. Perfect. Let me hit that enter button. Prepare yourself. Death awaits. Wow, wow. Ready? Go! Oh. Cheers to Poos. So close, that last one. I doubt you will make it as far. Your starting deck. Let's go ahead and take a step back. Hmm, you've plucked that from the oil painting. You must not like the cards that I deal you. Fine. What? What happened? Oh, wait a minute, I see. See how it has the hex pattern there? Yes. You finally pried my special dagger from the paws of that squirrel. 
Though you may wish that you hadn't. It's a mulligan. Shit. I wish I knew that. I wish I'd known that. No, leave me alone, computer. Yeah, let's do some growers. So let's do the moving stuff. Wait, what? Who's that? Who? It, it looks different. Huh. Are we gonna go stigil or sigil stacking? Huh? Stack it up on this dog. Mm -mm. Oh, I wanted to do the hard battle. I wasn't looking ahead enough. Get, 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 get. So what's this do? You're not the first to lose an eye here. This isn't much fun if you're half blind. Perhaps you'd like to replace it? Yeah. Ooh. I assume I should be drawn to this one. Okay. Okay. Regardless, the choice is final. Going to the clock last. Wow. I feel like I have a black light in a teenager's room. This is gross. Okay. So probably, 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 the way this works is that I need it to stay contained within the shape. So that's what would indicate to me whether something is in there or not. Take the film roll before he sees it now. Okay. Alright. What are you up to over there? Now I need to develop a film roll. Wow. 
What? I do relish snuffing out your excess candles before a boss. Perhaps you will now enjoy it as much as I do. Oh. Huh. How do I develop a camera? So much weaker than last time. Last time I was like overpowered, man. That was awesome. On a three coster, the great Y. Give me that. All right. She moved in with a certain vigor in spite of her considerable age. Flying. I, mean, I think this is probably the best utility. Is this little dum dum. All right. What is with me and just messing with this shit? How has it been? It has been quite bad. I am trapped in the body of a stoat, in the paper of a card. I see that. And I have, of course, set up a way to reset once more. <coughs> Our player friend here, they are they already hold the key. Swank on both sides. Let me just. All right, we are here. He's a 4-4, four, four, hell yeah. Alright. Dude, I have I, like I have a lot of teeth somewhere to spend here. I really gotta start dumping some stuff. Okay. Casey? I mean, this seems like a character. I'm gonna take her. Or maybe it's like Child 13. Alright, she's not talking, so I'm just gonna put her on there. Okay. <laughs> she's gonna put it on this guy. Taste of my former glory. All right, let's go go for the tough fight. Yep. Yeah. All right, bird scooters. Sure. Don't even give a damn. Took the film roll. Is that correct? My plan nears its moment of truth, but you must defeat him first. Nice top deck. <laughs> Terrific. Put him here. We'll just deal deal the quick two. Deal the quick two. Tooths, tooths. I hate having to play legit. It just stinks. Total misplay. Shut up. Caw -caw! All right. Let's 
So it's literally Twitch chat, dude. It's so true. Level one coster, Raven Egg, welcome. I don't actually have a lot of good ways to. Because uh, I feel like one mana things that grow are helpful. Kim Paul, the wood carver. This is full of bees, right? This is a good way to block damage. Oh my god, Dalek 12 gifting us a beautiful 9 on a Friday. Happy Friday to you. Give me them smokes. Greater smoke. Oh, I see. The game is just letting me get more and more and more powerful to help encourage me along. You passed a massive empty bowl surrounded by heaps of unidentifiable giblets and scantlings. It seemed the bowl was designed for a dog. What earthly hound would require a meal of that size? We meet again. Alright. Alright, put this wolf here. I'm gonna hang on to most stuff, because I think the wolf will just win it by itself. damage. I only need to deal one damage, so I think the, the right thing to do is to just... Raven Egg has... Ugh. I'm just gonna play this Greater Smoke. Because this will deal the one damage that we need to win. There's gold in them cards! Alright. So this is going to buy us a few turns. Oh, they die. They do turn into... They do turn into bones. do this a lot. Just get masses of these. So we found the stunted wolf. They have seen this play out enough times to know that a plan is in motion. Make haste. Alright. Oh, thank God. Shit, it has flying. Fuck. It's so annoying. Ugh. Prospector boss again. So let's get the B here. Let's play the stow by sacrificing the B and going here. Yeah, I'm I'm positive. And I'll chill. I really need this to die. I mean, it's so much easier when you just have, like, seven 
overkill damage in the very first turn. Like, it's so much better. Just saying. BB. Great white. Oh, come on. That's the play. Yeah, my mule. Since we'll kill this, this will deal too. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, it's just squirrel should be fine. Turkey vulture. All right, so we're gonna deal a bunch of overkill damage, huh? Do I have a bee here? No, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna end it, man. Lots of stuff. So many bones. You see, with bees, I need a lot of bones. With bees, I need bones. We get the mantis god. Why not? I don't get the mantis god. Free of the prospector's unhinged gaze. You looked ahead. Of course I did. It's a one-one god. Yeah, it's a very Magic the Gathering kind of name. A moment. As the air grew humid, your boots became harder to pull from the mud. The wetlands. All right. So we're hunting for fires. Uh, three sigils. Must be Ken. My cards are trash this run. I think this is the only one. Um, what what makes these Ken? I assume that these guys talked and that made them kin, but what makes them kin? This is, okay, non-rhetorical question. What does it mean by kin? Non-rhetorical. Top left? Top left icon. Oh, I see. Here's the watermarks. I see. 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 That? Or a cockroach? Cockroach seems fucking sick. Bone flapper seems good. I think it's going to be between bat and cockroach. I'm not entirely sure. This gives items. But I do need bones. I'm gonna get a bone flapper. Yeah. Oh, fuck yeah. Alright, nice. So then each one just automatically makes two immediately. I wonder if I have enough to make two that I get to bring two. I doubt that's the case, but... Squirrel! That? I 
That's nice. That ramps me, like, ridiculously hard. So I can start grabbing some three costers. Raven Egg, great. You gotta get all tactical and shit when you have bad cards. I much preferred when my shit was fucking busted. Stunted wolf. Alright. So I'm gonna deal. I'm gonna deal two damage every turn. Alright, I miscounted. Seems good. So I don't have anything to combine. I'm gonna hook like this. I want the price here once. It's Ingoline! Oh my god, we have fucking Ingoline! Oh shit, welcome! Ingoline! Looking fine. Let's see, do we see any campfires up there? Maybe. Maybe go this one's the only one we can do. We did it, we got Ingoline. Alright. Uh, Mantis God, let's put you on a... Oh my god, on a great white shark? Or maybe on an Ingoline, damn near fine. Yeah, I think Ingoline smacking for three. I mean, it's so easy to get. Alright. Craft. Oh! Yeah, I think it's just so hard to actually get the shark out. Which is why I'm... Cautious on it. I do like this. Because, I mean, I have my, my, my squirrels that can pound out power every single turn. Take four damage. I'm gonna do this. I'll scroll next turn. out again. Get one of these. That. That's win. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> so we can actually start getting pricier cards. Ringworm. Field mice? The licentious field mice. You will draw a copy when they are played. Great. We, we need things that are mana sinks. Alright, so let's see if we can... What if I wanted to copy... Um, I, I'm kind of into the idea of Raven Egg. There'd be a different one to go for. 
it grows up. Yeah, let's... This means I can flood with two threes. Then fly, so it deals damage. Seems like a good game ending play in a lot of situations. That. Alright, so we go. Squirrel. Rabbit. Dong. Shit, I forgot it fucking scoots. It's literally right there. Just, I just don't even know how I can forget that. It's just too much. It's too hard. So I'm going to go kill, kill. We have some river otter. All right, let's get the stoat. Different stoats for different folks. Back on the board, baby. Oh, yeah, overkill damage. Overkill for lots of teeth, and I think I just am keeping the teeth from run to run, right? Let's take a peek. No, I had so many teeth in that last run, I didn't do shit with it. Oh, I hate it all. I hate it so bad. Oh, yeah, corpse maggots, barrow, river snapper. Proud of I'm a big fan of damage. I don't like being passive. I don't like protecting. Wasted teeth just the worth. I know. I could have gotten a Grixis out of it. The warm light of a campfire was a welcome sight. Though the ten hungry eyes around it dampened. Who wants to become healthy and wealthy? What's going on with this one? If you must. What's this one? Cause here's Stoat. Here's Stinkbug. Isn't that my sweet wolf? No, that's the sweet wolf. I see. Um I'm gonna put on the egg because I think that that's gonna be the biggest issue with it. Is it, is it dying? But if I can just like play it every single turn, that'll be red. Give me them smokies. He beheld an immense man slouched behind a mucky pond. He appeared to be tearing hunks of flesh from a fish corpse. He's the angler. Okay. Okay. Go fish. So don't we win again? Let's see how this fucker works. Oh, I did I did understand it correctly. That's so sick. 
fish. Incredible. Yeah, Mantis Lord try attack multi attack is just disgusting. That's really good. Perhaps one of these will entice you. Yeah, maybe. I guess Urayali, but I'm not even that excited about that one. I mean, I can cast it. The angler's foul smell slowly fades as you continue on. After all, why shouldn't I? Why not, Gek? <laughs> oh, yes, I know. Alright, so... Oh, this way to the trapper. Card bearing the sigil is played. You may search your deck for any card and take it into your hand. Yeah, fuck yeah, are you kidding me? We have, like, the, the fact is we have squirrels that can do mana generation because squirrels make rabbits. Oh, I'm definitely using this thing. I'm excited, I'm gonna use it immediately. I'm instantly using this. I'm serious, you cannot use that. There is no possible use for it. I'll place it on the shelf over there for now. My advice, avoid it. Yes! Fucking yes! So, let's see, that'll be one, two, three damage, and the mole will be a bit of a pain. Alright. So we'll take some damage. Bang. It's another mole, so great. So we do this. And then we do this. So we just do this to kill the, the big one. Mana is sick. That? Dude. Dude, we're gonna get a lot of bonus teeth here. Dude, look at this. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, Trapper. Oh yeah, dude, that is just good timing. I mean, this is good timing. The trapping business has been lagging after being defeated by that challenger. Well, I'm thinking of clearing the inventory, trying something else. Pelts are cheaper now. them together can I get can I like merge my golds yeah hell yes dude <laughs> I want to see this I don't even know what this does we have all these pelts because things that we're, we're, we're sort of like a spiky Kind of combo-y deck. Like, if we get a couple of our juicy ones in here. Shiny. Uh, 
These are all gonna become two fours, huh? Uh, I'm just gonna break it, like... I'm just gonna go out with... Big damages. Stacking them up more, woo! Alright. Yeah, there, there's probably a better play there, but I don't really care. I don't really care. We're just moving on. Three sigils, four power, five bones. Probably not bones. I don't actually have a lot of sigils. Four power, three, one, 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 two, zero, two. Yeah, the, the, the biggest hope is sigils, probabilistically. Let the trial of wisdom begin. That's okay, I don't need more cards. Maybe I can even cut through this way. Yeah, all right. Cool. Yeah, so this this seems like a reasonable one to get a one mana mega spike. All right, so this is thorns damage, right? Or is this power? Sharp quills struck strikers then dealt a single damage point. Elk Fawn, huh? I think. So we're, we're gonna have another rabbit. If I can get something that's three. Actually, th this will work. I can get the raven egg. And this guy's flying. So then what I can do is I can... Rabbit out the raven's egg. And the turn. And then I can just fill my board with raven eggs. Oh, that's right. They don't grow on the back. Oh, okay. All right. I have make you a mistake. -y. Yeah, that's just really nice. Oh, health on the Raven Egg was just, was just incredible. I mean, that was incredible. I mean, look at this. Now I just fly past everything. That's... I mean, that's really, really nice. That's... I mean, that's terrific. Oh! Ah! Oh, ah! Oh. Day 9. Absolute Gamer. I just take one and go. I guess we'll do a pronghorn. We can possibly upgrade it or other such scary babies. Alright, health. Alright, so I mean this this is clear. What we're gonna do is we're gonna upgrade the Raven Egg again. Cause then I have like defense and guaranteed damage in the air. I mean that's incredible. Vromnus just gifted five subs, and I also see Vromnus. Just got timed out. I can't tell if you're backseating or just flirting with Ghost Stalker. Either way. We're going in the skies. Doubling up. Extinguish. Exsanguinated. Different smokes for different folks. You took in the familiar sights and scents of the Trapper's Pelts. Something was different. Mm -hmm.
Uh, quick question. When these die, th these are just blockers right now. Who's the person that buys them? This is this is a non-rhetorical question. It's time to backseat me. It's time to backseat me. What? Do, who do I sell these to? When do these sell? Trader buys them. And what's the shape? Box crate, yeah, okay. Looks like a PC, great. Cause I really wanna offload this garbage. We have lots of time now. This is like so good. Being able to play like two Raven Eggs a turn. We're just gonna absorb like all this damage. Another non-rhetorical question, is there a maximum hand size? No, thank goodness. Didn't seem like it. Sure didn't seem that way. that every time. And if you've not seen uh, what we do in the shadows, you're gonna wanna. It's really good. Dude, Raven Egg infinite combos are legit. Perfect. Ah, it is the end of my turn. Trade, okay. Hope you brought pelts. I now understand the mechanics. All right, great. Resources. Resources, please. But I, we would just like fly in in the air and just win anyways. It's incredible. I mean, like, I, this like mass Birdman thing is awesome. Need a light? one, man. The animal ghost says, can the eggs be sacrificed for another egg? Infinite loop. It's an infinite loop, but it doesn't really do anything. The mystery of the trapper and trader occupied your thoughts as you went onward. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, yes, I know. 
It is infinite bones, though. Yeah, but I, I don't really have a way to spend infinite bones. Like, I can do stuff, but I can't, like, do stuff. You know what I mean? Oh, is this? Is this it? The trader's post was left abandoned. As a sign of respect for the strange woman, you took only what you could afford. Shit. Ooh, amalgam's good. I don't think that's incredible, but I think it's okay. I think it's okay. Because, like, our deck gets kind of diluted. The warm light of the cabin cut through the thick fog. Surely your tribulations ended here. Why combining pelts is OP? That's sick, man. Oh, all of them become fused if you only have one fused pelt. Oh my god, I'm insane. Oh yeah. A rare opportunity arose. The great bones of Leshy's Woods were on offer. I know it said boons, but I wanted to say bones. If you have a ring, you automatically pass. Well, I have a ring tattoo. We have none of these. We just got rid of all of our pelts. We have like one with this? Wait. It said success? Oh, the, oh, 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 absolutely, absolutely this. We have lots of rare cards in the list, because we just sigiled them up. Gotcha. Perfect. All right. Well, you managed to get both of my boons. I rarely say this, but I am impressed. You've been a worthy adversary, but unfortunately, I must soon put you to death. say i'm i'm really surprised at the hype around inscription i mean part of me wants to say that viewership is good today um i do let's talk later oh my god like the hype around inscription is just incredible like i like to think that it's my charming heartwarming personality I like to think that it's my charming heartwarming personality that's causing y'all to show up. But I gotta be real with you. This is one of these interesting tales of a game that got more and more, first of all, was popular, which is rare enough for a game. Second, gets has grown in popularity since its release. And third, people want to tune into. Poly550 just gifted 10 subs. Oh my God, thank you. Oh my God, thank you. Poly 550. Poly 550, I dedicate this crushing victory to you. I'm back. Sit. And by the way, um, oh, how I relish this moment. Let, I want to stress something one more time. Please don't spoil. I saw some comments in here that um, were 
very spoilery uh, just recently. Um, and a lot of times people think that hinting and nudging is not spoilery. Don't do that. So, for instance, someone was saying, oh, there's no way you're going to be done with this game today. Which implies to me that when I beat this, there's something afterwards, which now makes me feel really disappointed. So please, no spoiling. Please, please, pretty please, don't even imply that shit. All right. Oh, how I relish this moment. Yeah, I caught you, Allied Russian. I got you, man. Only takes one. Two flames will not suffice. Let's go for three. Now, let's see if my, my theory from before was correct. See what happens. See what happens. So there's the round face. There's the wrinkled face. And there's the half face. So that's that's what turns my stuff to gold. going to deal gold damage to all my things next turn, huh? So if I did squirrel, rabbit, and did the douse like this. Oh, that's a bellist. Oh, I thought that that was the... My brain melted. I thought that this was the spawn symbol that's on this egg. I fucking lost? Oh, shit. I fucking keep screwing up the turn order, man. Oh, my God. I literally had more than enough opportunity to be able to win. Oh, my God. I just... I was so focused on his back head. Ah, fuck. Gotta go slow on those last ones. Oh, no, no. That, that, like, Jesse, that was not the issue. The issue was I was looking at the dude's face. I was looking at the dude's faces and I was just doing nothing but staring at those. And I took all the time I needed to correctly study the face and understand what was going on. And I just fucking then passed the turn because I wasn't paying attention to the board. Uh, power and health. Ooh, this one's really terrible. All right, let's get this over with, and I'm gonna use the restroom. Let's get this over with. Brodeo Clown, give me a number between three and six. Not 16, just three and six. Just three and six, Brodeo Clown. Ah, that was a disappointing one. Six, all right. All right, Zuzu's Lana, give me the first letter. We gotta go through this, let's just do a short name. Come on, fast, fast. If you, don't, if you don't answer, if you're not snapping along, we're going to call on someone else. Zuzu Zulana, come on. Give me letter number one. Give me letter number one. Come on. Don't say OMG. Give me a letter. Z. Perfect. All right. 
Zorel with an X. Give me letter number two. Come on, come on, come on. Give me letter number two. Let's go. At me, at me, at me. Use at. Oh, we got Zo. Uh, let's see. Metal Fulu, Metal Fulu. At me, you at me for letter th letter three. Metal Fulu. Zo, we got Zo. I'm so annoyed that I died in that last one. We were busy studying and learning. Fucking sucks. R. Zor. All right. Purified 100. Give me letter four. We're halfway done. We got Zor. Don't succumb to peer pressure. Don't succumb to peer pressure. Microphone, I didn't call on you. Don't at me. Purified 100. Hit me with it. Hit me with it. We're Zor. Secret Fortis says you are so annoyed. I am so tilted. I am fully tilted. Zoru. All right. Zossy, give me letter number five. Give me letter number five. Letter number five, staying alive. Z, Zoru's. And the final letter to close it out is going to be Witty, Adrian. Good to see you, Witty A. Give me that letter number six. Give me that letter number six. X. Zorusk, 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 Zorusk. It's like so fucking hard to say. Dude, this card fucking sucks. It's a good name for a terrible card. Goodbye. How irritating. How irritating that run was. You losing an instance. The last challenger made it all the way to the end of the path. They were not prepared for what awaited them there. Yes, I was. What are you looking at? Keep your eyes on me. That foul, stunted wolf. You really want a creature in your deck? The sight of it does try my temper, but has been dealt. So it stands. All right. Adder and Squirrel? What? Oh, is this... I play this if I want to get a mulligan on the next one? Arg! The pain is unbearable. Even after all these years. What do you want? I have very little to live for these days. Arg, it is done. The Master is free. Oh, the end must be close now. If Magnificus is free, it must be close. Watching the Angler lose. Now suit my pain. The old rival of mine, that fisherman. Hmm. He bested me this time, but I will have another chance. Oh, I see you have a little something special up your sleeve. Fear not. I won't blow your cover. You just need to get a hold of that camera of his. Maybe if you defeated him, you would get a chance. You? Yes, I see that you have a little something special. All you need is an opportunity. Okay. Alright. Alright. 